But I mean, you, you seem like you're doing well. I mean, you're not even wearing boots, so. No, I am wearing boots. What are those? Party in the back. Well, I guess I'm just gonna go throw scrambles in a lava pit then, since everything's good for you. Scramble craft will never be the same. Welcome back, everybody. I am sitting in a giant crater that I created using an item we got last episode. I'm talking none other than an atomic C4 bomb. Thanks to your guys' help and a lucky item that we got, we were able to create this. And we'll just blow one up for the start of this video just for fun so we're actually gonna make a double crater here a crater with inside a crater so we put five seconds on that thing and yeah we're just gonna let off a casual atomic bomb explosion oh man cody and cannibal crab better be shaking in their boots baby just sounds like a a recipe for yep slowness okay okay we're gonna stay far away from that oh that just got craterized that just got craterized should probably eat up a little bit so we can heal. Oh my gosh. How did that Teletubby survive? He did get a little deformed though. Yeah. That. You know what? We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to get rid of that thing. <laughs> Check it out. So this item is super powerful as you can tell. And uh. Yeah. It's gonna be a lot of fun messing around with it. What do we have here? Oh is that the. Those are geodes. Yeah. Those are the blue geodes. Today's a cool day because Cody and Mike are both on the server. Maybe we can cause mass destruction. They don't know the power I have yet. I will, I'm sure some people commented, but I don't know if they read their comments yet. But I did read my comments, guys. And I read that Cody's actually had a lot of bad luck recently. He actually lost all his items twice. He lost his butterfly leviathan. And, well, now his arch enemy, me, Kraken Kid, has atomic C4 bombs. So, he might need a little pick-me-up, and you guys were thinking maybe I could decide to be nice. Maybe I could show him a little bit of support, and maybe I could give him back the hostage. I don't know, though. Oh, and Cody just teleported to Mike. Interesting. Maybe they're working against me. And he just did it again. Huh. So, I, I, I'm kind of conflicted here, guys, because Cody is my arch enemy. He did, he did, uh, you know, kind of screw me over and steal a bunch of my items, but he's also had a really bad time. Do I go ahead and release scrambles into his possession? If I do that, then he has to relinquish all the items. You know what? Maybe it may be. Ooh, this is, this is tough. All right. I'm going to think about it for now. We're going to go back home. So a few of you guys are a little bit concerned that I left the villagers here um, because Cody and Mike could technically come up here and I should probably get that away from them just so it don't make it super easy for them to come steal my stuff. Uh, yeah, you were concerned that Cody and Mike would come here and steal my Atomic C4 seller or just start trading them and get them themselves. I agree. I should... I wanted to keep this village... You know, strictly a war village and get all the other types of statues too. get them all up to atomic. But you guys are right. I probably should move it. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Not right now, but I am going to do that. We'll just have to find a secret village somewhere, put a waystone and hide the coordinates. So Cody and Mike cannot find us. Now, if you look up statue. Now, the interesting thing here is guys, Statue of Liberty. Uh, this one gives it a pr Oh, I don't know what that one does. This one's the rifle ammo. This one's the shotgun ammo. This one's the rockets for our rocket launcher, which we already have. And there's an atomic ro rocket. There's an atomic shotgun ammo. There's an atomic rifle uh, if we search atomic. So that means we can get the ammo for all of these things if we find this recipe for the statue. Oh, man. We need to get that stuff. Like, right there. There's the atomic bomb rocket. <sighs> that is the goal. So, we're going to have an entire village that is dedicated to creating Kraken atomic weapons. That sounds pretty good to me, if you <laughs> if you want to know. Um, so, the past few episodes, I've been slacking on Fans of the Day, and I've been slacking on Buddy Cards. 
So I think what I'm going to do right now is clear out my inventory. I think we're going to go open a few packs of buddy cards and get a fan of the day done early so I don't forget towards the end of the episode. Then we can decide what we want to do with Cody. Oh, man. I don't know. I'm really conflicted right now because I want to keep the war going. On the other hand, I do have all the power so I can show a little bit of mercy right now. And if I show a little bit of mercy, you know, maybe he, he'll be more likely to do stuff for me. And him and Mike are definitely conspiring right now to do something because they are in a Discord call together. They're in the recording channel number two. I'm in recording channel number one. They're together. They're on the server. Cody kept TPing to him. So I think I need to get calm down Cody a little bit against me and show him some mercy. Let him, you know, think Craig is such a good guy. I can't believe I betrayed him by trying to steal his items. I know I could go get those items. A lot of you guys are like questioning why I didn't go get all the items in the lab. I understand I could get them, carry them up here, but I don't want to have to do that. I don't want to have to take the time to do that. I don't think I should have to take the time to do that. I want Cody to feel so bad that he brings them back to me. Replaces them in the chest where they truly belong and admits his wrongdoing. So that's why I haven't done it, you know. And, and I don't think there's anything super valuable down there. It's just like annoying. It's just, you know, Co can't believe Cody did that. All right, so we are at my secret undisclosed location. The, my buddy hall, my collection of buddy cards, baby. And here we go. So let's go ahead and open up two mystery buddy card packs because we haven't done it in a while. So boom and boom. Let's see what we can get. Hopefully we got some new stuff. It looks like we have a lot of the nether set. So let's go ahead and get them out first. And we have an ultra rare. We have an ultra rare number 26 beaker. So that's the second rarest card that you can get from the buddy cards. Or, or from the nether set specifically. Because I think it goes up to 27. Alright, so then this is 6, 7, 11, and 26. Alright, come on. Are we going to get anything new? 6, 7, 11. Crap. So the first three commons were not new, but this ultra rare is going right there, baby. Number 26. Whew, that is nice. Wait, is that the right spot? 18, 21, 24, 25, 26. Yeah, okay, it is. And here we go. Holographic number three is actually a duplicate too. Duplicate hollows, man. You don't see those a lot. All right, what set are we going to go to next? Let's go ahead and do the create set. Nice and small. And we'll get a base set as well. Two uncommons there. And a common hollow. So 14 and 15 for the uncommons. 14 is duplicate. 15 is new. We'll take that. And the holographic number four. Slide on in. There we go. Do we have any farmer's delight? We'll just do them in order. Um... We do. We have a common and an uncommon. Four and eight. Those are both going to be new. So the small sets like this, we're definitely going to have a lot of duplicates. And this one's only missing four more cards. Uh, let me know what set do you guys think I'm going to finish first. So we got five and 21 for the non hollows And they are duplicates. Oh, wait. No. Never mind. I was wrong. 21 is a new uncommon and for the hollow we have 13 and that is going to be new 13 14 15 perfect 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 we did not get a single card from the end set what the heck that's kind of weird that's usually one of the most common ones we did however get three aquaculture so let's go check out those one 12 and two holographic so one is not new and 12 is, though. That uncommon is coming in nice. Is that a jellyfish? It is. It's a jelly. Take that jelly. That's very nice. Okay. So one is going in there. So this one has four left as well. Oh, they're getting close. And this was number two, which is going to be new. We actually sucked pretty bad at that set at the beginning, but it's come a long way, so I'm excited. And now we're at the biomes you'll go set number 20 uncommon and 
three common. Three is going to be duplicate, and so isn't 20. All right, so it is fan of the daytime, guys, and it was actually the last set we had to give away. I'm talking none other than the Farmer Delight non-holographics. Congratulations to Zane Chote. The hashtag was hashtag Atomic C4 from last episode. Not very, very nice. Oh no, I got rid of my Cloud Pets energy. We need to get out of here. All right, we gotta go back to Kraken's home. Oh man, so I really, I don't know what to do with Cody, guys. I'm kind of at a loss here. Ultimate infusing factory. We'll take that. I really, really need to get going with that create stuff. I know I keep saying that, but I think next episode I'm going to fix it and we can try creating our very first machine. That'll be cool. I don't think any of the other guys have messed around with it yet either. So I don't think I'm too far behind. So we actually got some pretty cool stuff. I'm just dump chesting it right now in this shulker box I had over here. Uh, but the mecha suit helmet is probably my favorite item we just got. Um, if you see something that's better, please let me know. Oh, we got T45 leggings, too. And a crucible sword! Oh my gosh! It's, a, it's an expired one. I didn't even realize that's what that was. So, the crucible sword is the one that has, like, four shots, and it's, like, 45 and a half attack damage each. Uh, but then, you, you, after four shots, you need to recharge it somehow, and I still do not know how to do that. So, and that was, was that fun mod? We got fun mod piece. So we did get a bunch of cool stuff, guys, uh, but definitely the mecha suit helmet and the T45 leggings are probably my favorite finds from that. Let me see. There was a few items I didn't pick up, but I don't think anything super rare. I wonder if there's a way to automate this stuff, guys, because honestly, every time I do this, I get, you know, one or two good things. And if I could automate this using some of the create mod stuff, I could really put a hurting on Cody. Like, in Mike with, like, getting really good items fast. So, I mean, just take a look at... Where do I have it? The Mecha Suit Pant. So, that's why I was so excited that I got the helmet. Because I already had a piece of it. And we can go place our T45 leggings. Which I think I got the boots for this episode. Or maybe, like, last episode. But, yeah, that is, that is pretty sweet. We're halfway done. One of the power suits. And then we got the Mecha Suit. We do need a way to charge this stuff, though. But I'm really excited to have this. Um, let's go ahead and put it right there. It'll be the mech. Ooh, that's going to look sick. I like the little green accents. Yes. That armor is going to be awesome. So, screw it. Let's go get scrambles and then decide what to do. I still don't know what I'm doing, by the way, guys. We could literally go to Cody and destroy scrambles right in front of him. Or we could go there and be super nice. Uh... Yeah, yeah. Oh, there it is. Scrambles, tamed by the Cody Maverick. Now we have Scrambles in our hand, guys. What do we do? That is the big question. Oh my gosh. We could destroy Cody's dragon right now. But that might not be the smartest idea, or it might be the smartest idea. If I destroy him, he's definitely going to come for these dragons, so I'm going to need to get a lot more dragon soul crystals, because uh, I only have one, and it's got my Charizard in it right now. Charizard, my royal red dragon. You are a beast, my friend. Oh, and he's got the armor on him. I haven't flown Charizard in a few episodes. I miss it. Look it. Feel the wind in my hair. All right, guys, we're gonna fly over to Cody's base and we're going to, I still have no idea what we're gonna do, but we're gonna do something. We could be nice or we could be mean. We could be nice or we could be mean. What the heck is going on over here? How? Oh, hang on, let me jump into his call. Cody! Ma'am? What are you doing? Do you wanna, do you have a return? Cody, seriously. Whoa, you just pushing my dragon around like that? I I'm not pushing around your dragon. Ch Charizard, come here, Charizard. I gotta get you. I can't get inside the crystal. Oh my gosh. I gotta get to the center. Are you pushing that? Yeah, stand still. Ow, ow. Okay, Cody, this this is ridiculous. I can't get out. <laughs> he literally trapped me at all. All right, you're fine. What the heck is going on over here? 
Cracking, no one's supposed to see this. This is top secret military information. Uh, oh my gosh, you messing around with the create bot. I just said I'd, I'd been slacking in that and I should probably do it soon. Oh my, dude. Is that too fast? It's too fast, right? Cody, do you have what, see what I have in my hand? I got my Charizard, but then I also have this. Is it Scrambles? It's Scrambles, Cody. And I don't know what I want to do with him yet. I could destroy him. Oh, I could be nice and give him back to you. I heard you've had a uh, some rough time on Scramble Craft lately. Rough time? No, we're having the best times. Oh, okay. Never mind then. But I mean, oh. if you don't want Scrambles, go. I mean, you uh, I'll take Scrambles back. Uh, yeah. No, I. You know, I do need to pick me up. Uh, I've had a rough time. We all. I heard you lost all your items twice, and then you, you, your your other dragon died, and and. But I mean, you, you seem like you're doing well. I mean, you're not even wearing boots, so. No, I am wearing boots. Yeah. Party uh, in the back. The free runner boots make me speedy and also agile and also walking up blocks automatically. Yeah. Okay. And they're a lot better than the Minecraft auto jump. It's like so much better. Well, I guess I'm just going to go throw scrambles in a lava pit then since everything's good for you. Kraken, cra please. I'll show you what this machine does. I'll tell you. Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah, how about this? You you help me out with this stuff when when I, when I get there. I need to fix my. Oh, I need to fix my stupid factory because of Cannibal Crab. Cannibal Crab. He's the worst man. He blew up my factory. That you're just recording a video with him today. I saw you guys in Discord together. You planning a secret bomb? There's already been three bombs under your base. Go check under your pillow. You know what? You've been well, snuggling. Not a blanket or a pillow. You've been snuggling a nuclear bomb. You yeah. may want to get checked for radiation burns. <laughs> it's funny you should bring up nuclear bombs, Cody, because... You just drop on! I have atomic C4. You better Go be... guys, we go! Wait, atomic C4? I have atomic C4, Cody. And you're screwed. Okay, bye! Wait, is it a, is atomic bomb C4? It'll create oh. the entire server, C4. That's cool. Get lost, Cody. Stop chasing me. All right, all right. Ah, uh, I gave him back scrambles. Yeah, I don't need scrambles anymore. Is well, like the final decision in my head was like, I don't need scrambles. I have atomic C4. He can't touch me, man. He can't touch me. He can't do anything against me. Like before, I had scrambles as leverage, so that's why he wasn't gonna do anything crazy. But now, I have this. Nope, not that. That's the smoke. No, that's the high explosive. This. Atomic C4. Okay. Atomic C4. What does Cody have? Nothing. Nothing. Nothing is powerful. Nothing is powerful. Uh, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like. And if you wish to be the next fan of the day, comment down below. Hashtag good guy cracking. Because, you know, I was a good guy today. I showed mercy. I gave him something back to him that was precious. And he took off in the sky. I think that deserves some praise. Alright, we'll see you in the next episode. Bye.